I don't want to bite anything, right? He couldn't lift up his arms. He couldn't lift up a fucking fork. His brain was still working, you know? He knew what was going on. He knew what the fuck was going on. But we kept together. Day after day. And it's just wasting away. And all those fucking nurses. They keep flinging about. They said, oh yeah. Stand back, we know what we're doing. And I said, if you know what the fuck you're doing, why does he look like a fucking rag? Don't hold the fuck up. Oh, and they had to have some with him, you know, just to, to help him piss, wipe his ass. But they would have had, have to have someone with him for every minute for the rest of his fucking life. Sitting around with a shit bucket and a mop, you know. Oh, and, and one day this fucking first year fuck of a nurse came. She just dumps this tray of shit in front of him and a cup of jello, this lime green shit. And dad, he was just humiliated. He was just staring at it. He, just, he was just humiliated, you know. I looked into his eyes. It's like everything's just disappeared. <laughs> Later on that night, I was holding his hands. He said something. I couldn't hear him, so I said, whisper into my ear, Dad. Yeah, so, so he did. And I said, I can't do that, Dad. I can't. But then he looked at me. He said it again. <laughs> and I just stood there. <laughs> I did it. I fucking did it. I did what I was told to do, you know. I only did what I was told to do. <laughs> shouldn't have hit yourself, huh? Shouldn't have fucking hit yourself, huh? What's inside of him? It's inside of me now. <laughs>